Okay, Elliot family, here is a huge Trader Joe's haul. Today, um, not at Trader Joe's, it's a, it's like a organic tropical blend. You can put it in your smoothies. Awesome addition. You have bananas, strawberries, pineapples, um, and also mangoes. Pineapple uh, tidbits. You can put these in also in the smoothie. K-Money's allergic, so she won't be having any of this. We have an organic mango. Awesome addition to put in your smoothie as well. The peanut organic powder with sea salt. You can add that to your smoothie. Baking cookies and things of that nature, but this is awesome. It's very powerful, and you can add that to a smoothie as well. Organic flaxseed Trader Joe's is awesome. It's very good. You can add it with smoothie, pancakes, and things of that nature. Also, another addition is also it has a lot of fiber things in it, um, and it's filling too. Organic fruit and seed. I like to put these on top of my smoothie after I'm finished. Uh, you can put it in a smoothie bowl or put it on top of your um, smoothie drink. Add a little crunch and has a lot of um, granola. It has um, coconut, cranberries, and also raisins. Here we have some hemp seed, also a great addition to add to your smoothie. You have your, um, your omegas, three, eight, six fatty acid. Here we have some chia seeds. This is also good to put in your uh, smoothie, it has omega four and three. You can add that to your smoothie, great uh, addition for, um, and it's very filling too. So when I make smoothies and I add all these through, it's very filling. Um, stevia, if you want to cut back on your sugar intake, it's good to put a couple drops of stevia in there. You can add it as a sweetener alternative. The Dijon Monster is also good to put on any type of spread on a sandwich. If you like hot dogs, you can add that to that. Really good. It has a little spicy kick to it, but it's awesome. This in here, we have some watermelon already cut up. Already cut up, they're really good watermelon. Here, here we have some mushrooms, polabella. I would like add, saute this. Has some um, green pepper. Then also um, egg whites. You know, you can add like egg whites to it. And uh, it's a great addition. These are already mixed. And egg whites, pretty good. So... If you do one, um, three tablespoons is for one large egg, one third cup is for two large eggs, three fourths is for four large eggs. So here we have some oranges here. There's a pretty large oranges. I have two pears, a bag of pears or organic pears. Awesome, good addition. You can put, you can make like pies, like a pear pie or things of that nature, or you just cut it up. Eat it plain. We already uh, for it. It's really good. I can saute that with, with my mushrooms. Um, also with the green pepper. Awesome addition. Organic strawberries. Uh, really good. Packed in here for an uh, Trader Joe's. Already nice and ripe. Baby spinach. Awesome. Trader Joe's. Uh, this bag is 16 ounce. Good quality. Organic. Usually it lasts me for about a week or so. I'll add it to the smoothie. Or I'll go ahead and saute that with the egg whites, green cabbage. Um, cut this up, saute that as you can, or steam it. Um, pretty big. Okay. Bananas. I have bananas. I'll add to the smoothie also as well. Also got the everything Tabata roll. Well, these are awesome. I try to eat only a half because they are so so good. It has the own has seeds on and everything, everything, and it's so good. It has a garlic taste to it, poppy seeds. Uh, we have the onions on it, it is awesome. Half is the Alaskan salmon. Um, this is new at Trader Joe's. It's also, it's so good. On top, you already have the butter um, on top of the uh, salmon, and I just put it in the air fryer, and it is so, so good. When I tell you it's so good, I have two of those. Go ahead and saute me some spinach and eat that. Oh my goodness, awesome. Um, we have the uh, fresh cash scallops. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to eat these. Um, saute, saute this with like butter, things of that nature. Um, 
You can add um, spinach to it or olive oil, really good. And also it's wild caught, so this is at Trader Joe's. Pecans, I usually add the raw pecans to smoothies or, or I add it to a salad. Really good addition to Trader Joe's. Um, it's called raw pecan pieces. Raw walnut bake, you can add this to your salad or add it to the smoothie. I usually add it to the smoothie as well. Um, or I might sometimes add the pecan or use this. This is also good at Trader Joe's. The bag is pretty big size bag. Sunflower seeds here at Trader Joe's, they're roasted, uh, salted. They're lightly salted, they're in the shell. Awesome um, at Trader Joe's. Um, not too salty. We have the ancient um, grain and nut granolas. Um, you can add this and it has coconut oil in it. You can add this also to the smoothie on top or you can add it, you can eat it with the milk. So you can eat it or you can soak the oaks as well. It's a really good uh, product at Trader Joe's. Here it has um, oak flowers, it has oil and it has um, coconut oil and it has brown rice. So awesome addition. You add it to yogurt, things of that nature. Really good. Also here we have the mini thing snack. Um, this is so, so good. Um, and here you have like honey, roasted peanuts. You have spicy honey, butter, cereal squares, corn sticks, pretzels, savory um, bread chips. Awesome here at Trader Joe's. It's called mini things and snacks. Okay, so awesome stuff from Trader Joe's got today. Uh, this is a nice haul. I have some more things I would like to show, but here is all of all the things I got at Trader Joe's today. So that concludes it. So. Remember that we're coming with that fire content every single day. Stay blessed and highly favored. Peace.